Fence is going to be 10 feet. It's going to be a 10 foot fence. Hello everyone, welcome to the Foreigner Farming in the Philippines. So, one more block or that's it for the block? I don't know. I have, they have to, it depends. But the idea, the, the idea is to have a 10 foot fence. Um, two feet of hollow block and eight feet of, of bamboo. Gotcha. I'm looking, I'm checking out Anthony's fence here because we're, we're, we're going to, someday when we get the money together, we're going to put a fence up around our house. Uh, to keep the dogs in. The dogs are starting to be a little bit of an irritation to people walking by on the road. Uh, when the females come into heat, uh, it's a <laughs> it's chaos around there. Uh, we've really got too many to get fixed now. It's just too expensive to fix them all. Uh, when we get the ocean fish pens done, we're going to, of course, move them out there onto the ocean for guard dogs, five or six of the females we've got. Uh, Nini's going to get fixed. Twinkie's going to get fixed. We may keep one of the other females and get them fixed as well. And we'll keep all the males because uh, they don't have puppies. And we need the guard dogs. Uh, the more dogs you have, the better. But you can't have as many females running around as we do. But Anthony's fence here, he's just going to... Two, two hollow blocks. This is uh, angle iron here. I'm going to get down there and see you can see the angle. I guess you could saw that. I couldn't see what I was filming. But he's got two of these, one up here and one down there. And he's just going to use bamboo slats, screw them in top and bottom. I suggested he put a wood header along the bottom and he could nail that in as well on the bottom. I'm liking it. I don't know. I don't know if we would do as as the cement posts. These are like 8 by 8. What is this here? Yeah, these are eight by eight posts. Um, I, I'm thinking we would do more like four by four. Uh, but the cement posts are a must. You really can't use wood if you want a fence that's gonna be there for a while. But I'm thinking we would use smaller posts and probably a similar configuration of this. The angle iron is not that expensive. It's not cheap, but it's not, it's not prohibitively expensive. I think it's a couple hundred pesos for a 20 foot length. So uh, I'm, I'm liking this. The reason I, I came over here to look at this is because this is something similar to what we need to do just around the house, uh, maybe 200 feet, 250 feet all together. I haven't measured it, but that's what I'm guessing. Anthony's going to go all the way around this property with his fence. And in the back, is uh, he's, he was saying in the back it's going to be solo, solid hollow block, uh, but in the front here, uh, going all the way around, it's just going to be like this. It's going to be like this with uh, bamboo slats. I, I, I know I'm going to like the look of it. I think it's going to be a good looking fence. So I'm curious to see. I'm sure that he'll have most of it done before we even get started on ours. Because we got so much stuff going on that I, I don't anticipate us getting our fence done anytime within the next two or three months. What they're building here is the forms for the cement posts. <laughs> As you can see inside, it's a form bar, rebar. I'm thinking that's probably 10 or 11 and with 8 or 9 wrapped around it. Uh, the entire length of the post, <laughs> it makes a pretty strong post. I mean, you, it's not like it's just going to fall down. And then they'll <clears throat> they'll nail these forms together and just pour cement in from the top. And the next day or two, they'll knock the forms off, and it makes a post. back here and see what the girls are doing. Get away from that jackhammer noise a little bit. Thank you everyone. Please like, comment, share, subscribe.